everybody and welcome to an overdue episode of Jurassic World the game. Yes, you guys were like, Beaver, when, when are you going to make a video on the latest thing that's came out in Jurassic World the game? That being, of course, hold on, where is it? We're going to news, we're going to here, and we go to here. The Mosasaurus Gen 2 tournament, the longest tournament we've had in a fair while. Probably because this is something that I think everybody's going to want to get. And um, this is the first time that we've had a Mosasaur, I think, ever, or in a long time, ever since the first Mosasaur in another tournament. And it is lasting. The event ended. What? T tabulating final results. Tabulating? Is that a word? We didn't get the gold salamander. Ah, bit of a problem, isn't it? Oh dear. Also, so one thing I wanted to show is Ludia are actually clamping down on people hacking and cheating this game. Oh my god. It, I mean, it, it came a little bit too late, not gonna lie, but it's something that I thought they would never do. Um, and I think, uh, hopefully I'll put up an image of it or whatever they say. Um, they, it's something about making it fair. Making it fair for everybody. Um, I mean, we all know you don't fight real people in this game. It, it, it doesn't happen. Um, in this one. In Jurassic World Alive, you do. But in this game, it just makes more sense, I think. Like, they don't, it saves them money not having to have the servers, I think. Um, to fight real people. However, for the longest time... There was, there's been loads of people hacking this game, um, you know, getting as many currency as they can, and there being not a problem with it. Uh, we had this in Jurassic Park Builder, when Jurassic World the game came out, this one, again, not a problem with it. But, because Jurassic World Alive is so focused on PvP battles, and it being, you know, fair, and... They decided, okay, this time, this game, we're not going to allow hacking at all. You'll get banned, you'll get you know, whatever. But now they've released a statement saying in this game that they're going to be doing the same thing. They have uh, temporary bans, permanent bans, uh, removing from leaderboards, which I don't know how that works. Are you talking about the tournament leaderboards? <laughs> Can you not participate in tournaments? And this is, this is an interesting thing because I'm in loads of Facebook groups, and especially the one that um, is, you know, Jurassic World, the games, the group. Um, which was originally Jurassic World, the game, the group. Uh, in that one, it, a lot of people play this game. And a lot of people post uh, showing their, you know, their, their currencies and stuff. Now, I don't know how Lydia's going to go about seeing if people hack. Because with Jurassic World Alive, they can go into accounts and see it. So I'm wondering whether they can just organize, like, sorting from resources who has hacked and then if anybody's got like you know a million bucks you'll probably all get like removed or banned or something like that um but another curious thing i'll just open this pack while we, while i talk we might as well see something um the curious thing is what they're going to do about youtubers that have hacked this game for a long time i'm talking about all you know the all the the ones that have no commentary have hacked this game are they now going to be banned I don't think so. I don't think they will be. Um, I mean, it will set a precedent if they do. And I'm kind of glad now that I didn't hack. <laughs> I was very tempted though, Ludia. You almost forced me hand. Um, yeah, uh, and something I never expected to come out. I've got to admit. Okay, that's not worth it. That, however, is worth it. 500, please. Um, that's not worth Oh, is that worth two of those for 60? Yeah, I'll take the steel. Go on, then. It's a steal. Uh, food for that, and... No, God, no. I'll trade that for that, though, however. And a little surprise for all of you guys is if we go over to here... Da -da 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 -da, the John Hammonds have all returned. Well, they all got sold, and they all returned. So, hopefully... Oh, God, we've also got this. That's a free? Oh, it takes two hours. Can we just... Free. Okay, so here we go. Are you ready? Hopefully, we won't crash the game. I think we will. Oh, no, we didn't. We actually got to see it. Level 89. Done. A new expansion and a mystery pack. Beautiful, beautiful. We'll double that to 30. Um, 
Ooh, look! Ooh, wow, you know, oh, that kind of reminds me, like, when I first started playing this game, I'd only ever buy packs. I'd, oh, sorry, I, well, I would buy packs anyway. But, <laughs> ooh, high and mighty. I would never buy packs, but proceeds to buy all packs. Um, these packs I would always buy if it was legendary, because look at that, instead of 50 quid, five pound. For, and, you know, at the time when I was racing to get an Indominus Rex, you know, when the, the hybrids first came out in this game, I just got a level 40 T-Rex. Um, so yeah, uh, no, I'm gonna say goodbye. I'm gonna say goodbye. Bye bye. So we got one more level to get, um, and I'm just gonna get all of these, and then um, we could do one more expansion. Oh, I'm excited. So yes, we. I have not been participating in the Mosasaur tournament as much as I would normally do. I am definitely gonna unlock it though. The only reason I haven't been participating in it is because it is. Uh, I haven't had the time for a start, and it's like a week-long tournament, so it goes up a lot slower. So, at this point, if I was to participate in a normal tournament, it would be near the end, and if I hadn't participated in it, it would take hours and hours and hours to get into Dominator League. Uh, and we'll just click this. Oh, there you go! Level 90! And Battle Stage 90 unlocked, as well as a new expansion, as well as another pack. As well as, of course, another level 30. Ooh, ooh, look, ooh, Zinc Rewards. Look at that, that as a level 90 reward, you could get for the same price as the last one, 11 times the value, a Zinc Reward. Um, which, I mean, is awful, <laughs> but it's it's a freebie, I suppose. Um, and you get, you get, you don't get any books, uh, would you believe? That's not surprising. Uh, hold on a minute. Wait a second. This gold pack, it's a spe- Look at that, it's a special gold pack that you can just buy for $4.99. Or this one is $4.99. That's weird. So, they have in their system, Lydia has a system where this looks like a regular gold reward pack, but it's not. Um, it's deliberately designed to be a $4.99 gold pack, so it would never cost 50 quid. And you don't get books in it. So we're going to say goodbye to this. Uh, oh, there we go, we're at max. And now I'm going to go into card packs. Let's say we buy a... Ooh, well, before we do that. Let's say we buy a... Oh, can you not buy the gold packs? If you bought this one, do you get bucks in this one? You do get bucks in that one. Um, how about in here? Is there a gold reward pack that we can win? Oh, okay, here we go. Here is a normal gold reward pack. <gasps> they took books out of gold rewards? Oh, this is not good. Demorphodon? Oh, okay, that has a guaranteed 100. That's fine, that's fine. Uh, the food, of course, is only going to have food. If we win this pack, do you get bucks in this? No, you don't. No, you don't. Um, the Salamander statue, would you got books in this? You would have, but it's not many. Okay, so we're seeing a slight tightening up of rewards. I mean, that's okay. So some, I mean, <sighs> some packs now don't have books. And others now have a guarantee of books or DNA. Instead, you know, instead of it being like this, it looks like this. It's just a shame that now the gold rewards don't give you bugs. Ah, that is that is a big shame. Hmm. Well, we got a level 90, um, and we're... I mean, there's no point really uh, trying to get to level 91 at the moment. We'll excavate that, and I think we're going to excavate one more area. So I'm going to go this way. I'm going to try and dig through the forest. We can't... Oh, look, we can do that as well. And I wonder... Oh, yeah, that must be it. So we're going to save those two forest patches. 200 bucks is really not that much when you think about it. Um, okay, so what do we have? We have the 89 battle stage. So what do we get for this? 20%... Whoa, you're guaranteed a tournament creature? That's awesome. And you're guaranteed a legendary and guaranteed DNA. Uh, food's kind of meh. But what, what are we facing? Oh, fantastic, nothing that an Indoraptor can't take on. Me, oh my, die. Indoraptor, go, use your raking claws. Blah. Beautiful. And you can't do anything. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho. 
Right, okay, so we're just gonna go for two attack, because why not? We kill him in one, and even if you blocked for one, he'd still be dead. But you, on the other hand, 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, and four, I think it's four is a kill. Yep, goes for it. It's an overkill, but needed to just do that though. And then, oh wow, look at the attack and help on Lithornex. Or Lithronex. Wow, they're basically the same. And there you go, secured. A tournament creature, 180 bucks, as uh, 180 DNA, sorry. And a legendary. So what do we get? Yeah, we got Uranus and a Canto Steak. A Canto Steak is not bad. I'll take that one. It's better than having a Bloomin' um, uh, Ceratosaurus or another Ceratosaurus. Good lord. And the final one to win, a Mosasaurus. It's going to be more Indoraptors. I might as well just put carnivores and then scroll a little bit. And that'll do. That'll do. I'm pretty sure we got this in the bag. And swipe! So somebody wanted me to uh, get a level 40 Indoraptor once I've got all in like 12 Indoraptors. That's a high ask. <laughs> That's a tall ask. Pro Ceratosaurus dead. Oh, Teradostro has oh, 2,000 attack. 2,000, 4,000. Three attack he's going to have to do. Leaving one block. And Conoraptor has 900. One, two, three. Oh, 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 he didn't block anyway. Whoa, that was close. Oh, that could have been bad. And we win a Mosasaurus. As well as 180 DNA and Mosasaurus unlocked. Oh, you actually unlock Mosasaur. Wow. Look at that. A creature that we I had to stay up for 48 hours to win. You can now just get it. Fantastic. And yeah, uh-huh. Continue. Great. Thank you for letting me know. <laughs> okay, let's put in something that can easily hatch, like a Dilophosaurus. And now, let's have a look at a tournament creature that takes a long time. Oh, wait, what land creatures? Oh, we get 10% off. Land dinosaurs, 10% off in the market. Eh, it's not a great deal. Had more off in the past. So let's see. What do we have? The Ooh, whoa. We have a Segnosuchus. Oh, gimme. Six days. Oh, give me that. That's amazing. I must have I must have bought that when it was on offer like it is now, except for more than 10%. I wouldn't have bought it for 10% discount. Unless I won it? Okay, VIPs hatch instantly. Smithosaurus is another good one. Um, and then we need to look at tournament creatures because they take the longest. VIPs, we put that in. That's a wasted damn. <laughs> As the waste of digging it on time. However... Mmm, a Mosasaurus. Let's go. Activate. Oh, also, uh, I will put in a picture now of Mosasaurus level 40 as an Indo Gen 2 because people have won it. Um, not surprising. It looks kind of very, very similar to everything else. <laughs> All the other, um, oh, not, not similar to everything else. All the other, what you call it, uh, Indo Gens, like Velociraptor Gen 2, Indominus Rex Gen 2, and T Rex Gen 2. They're just the same base model, they just put a different skin on it. Um, and that's something that I, I suggested ages ago with Brawlosaurs. I said that what they should do is make celebrity dinosaurs. So have Rexy from Jurassic Park come in, or have, um, you know, the Bull T-Rexes from The Lost World, or the Spinosaur from Jurassic Park. You know, just give it a recoloring. That would be so cool. Um, but they, they still haven't done it yet. And I, I, I failed to see why. Um, and unfortunately now, uh, the Hasbro partnership that Universal had um, or a while ago now uh, dissolved because Hasbro lost the license to Jurassic, uh, which meant the Brawler Souls now, no, not now, but haven't for a long time were being compatible with the game. There's no way for you to access um, the camera function in the app. If you could somehow access the camera in this game, unless it's been removed completely, um, you could still use the Brawler Saws. But even saying that, the Brawler Saws weren't very good. They, um, I mean, what do they do? They, like, even when you get an Indominus Rex as a Brawler Saw, it was still only level one. Um, I think they tried to average them out because you had commons. Oh, 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 so sorry. Oh. When I talk a lot, I get yawny because my throat's like, stop. <laughs> um, uh, like commons, rares, and all that. They all try to make them even. 
So I think a legendary was like a level, a level 10, and a hybrid was level 1, a super rare was level 20, a rare was level 30, and a common was level 40. I'm trying to think if there was any commons. I don't think there was any comps, I'm not sure. But it's a shame that that compatibility has now gone out of the game. But we have now unlocked Clash of the Titans! Darwin Opterus. Now these battles are tough. And I've already used some of these creatures. Um, so we're going to have to think very carefully about how we do this. Um, I mean, we could look at a team of amphibians. Because that way there's no type matchup or disadvantage. And... Um, I'm quite tempted. I'm quite tempted to go for that. Because uh, even Acanthostega can survive two hits from a Metaposaurus, but their attack is, you know, it's similar. I think this this could be done. It's risky, but not too risky. So we have to go for one block here to make sure we survive. Look, this is only level 22 plus suitors. I got this guy for free. And he's taking on level 40. Okay, so that's good. So now we can go for two block. And then three reserves on the next turn, and then we'll have seven. Ooh, is that so? Well, we could go for three now and kill him. So should we do that? I think we should just do that. Yeah, just kill him. Because <laughs> Apatosaurus has to go for two hits to kill me, because he's only got 600. Out of his three, which leaves him with one attack or one reserve. Or one block? One extra attack. Okay, so same one comes in. Uh, so one, two... Uh, he could have five, so we're gonna have to go for, I think three kills us, so we're gonna have to go for three block, one reserve. Ooh, well, we played it safe, we played it safe. Let's see what he goes for. If he goes for four, we're good. Oh, we're good, we're good. Um, I think four is enough, one, two, three, four isn't enough. We're gonna have to go for five. Damn, that's a shame. That is a shame. Now, does it take two hits to kill us? Oh, it does. Oh, it's all to play for. It's all to play for. Oh, my God. It depends what he does here. It depends what he does. We could go for an all-out attack and kill him in... If he goes for one block, we've won. If he goes for two block, we've lost. One, two, three. Kills him. Please don't be more than one block. Ah, we've lost. Ah, close. Close. It was, it was too risky for me to go for um, anything that wasn't attacked there. Damn. But that's okay. We didn't even use our best creatures there. Um, I mean, what we could do is look for a flyer and then get a carnivore that's pretty decent and then just go for another flyer that's very good. Um, I mean, we want something that can survive two hits, possibly even three. So 700, 2000, it needs to have, yeah, that's it. That's it. I can survive three hits, I think. So we're going to go for one reserve right off the bat. Because two hits don't kill me from this guy. And Apatosaurus doesn't kill me in one hit. It does, yeah. <laughs> uh, one, two. Let's go for three. I could go for one block and made sure I survived there. But even if I did die, that's kind of what I want to happen. I want Praetorodum to come in. Uh, so this is great. Now I want to die. So I'm going to go for two attack here. Yeah, that's good. I want to make sure that Apatosaur thinks it can kill me. Um, however, it, it, well, let's go for three. It still doesn't. Okay, so I'm just going to try, you know, any damage I can do to it is good. Because that means, you know, I, I might be 100 off with Pritrodon and turning a three attack into a needed four attack. And that could be an extra. Oh, there you go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, that's 2,500. Pritrodon being another creature. I, oh, look at that. There you go. There you go. Because I did that attack. I kill it there. So one, two, three, and that makes sure that I can survive um, and have three reserves instead of only two reserves. And we've definitely won. Look at that. Look at that. Not really the best creatures, but decent. De de decent creatures. So. Oh, so the snare. Let's go. Uh, that kills. No, it doesn't. That does. And then we'll factor in two extra because we've we got, we got the dragon. Dragon's fine. And then he has to... Oh, one... Oh, no! Oh, he's got one... Ah, damn it! He's got one more attack than I have health. So he only has to go for two instead of three. Oh, wow. But now he's got 740. We can definitely go for, what, three block and two reserve here? Definitely. We're, we're safe. Even if he had six, he couldn't kill us in three. Ooh! Ooh! 
What you gonna do? Um, hmm. One, two, three. Uh, let's see if it's eight, seven, six, five. That's it, go for that. That's it, go for that. Yeah, we would have lost there. We would have lost, I think. Oh no, we would have won. Never mind. Bugger. I think two hits does kill him. Yeah, two hits does kill him. One, two, he's dead. Okay, there we go. <laughs> he keeps on blocking for four, but he's dead. Could have won that a little, you know, one round in. But hey, what you gonna do? James is an idiot. So we're gonna have no restrictions. Oh, that's what we want to see. Right, there we go. That'll do it. <laughs> Um, right, so we half their attack, so it's 750 or 770 attack. Um, I mean, we we can go for that, I think. I think that's good. Oh, that, I haven't even fed that guy. Whoopsie daisies. He's only level 31. Could have loads more health and attack. Okay, we need to feed Uyops. Get it level 40. Okay, you know what? I'm just going to go for I'm just going to go out. I'm just going. Oh, there you go. Well, oh, one more hit to kill him. Makes no difference to me. Two attack. Two attack. Yes! Yes! Your power becomes mine! And I fire it back at you. Actually, I only need to do one, didn't I? Whoops. <laughs> Super cool. I got excited there. Alright. What are you going to do? I can't the... Oh, I can't the Stegen. Oh, I can't the, oh, I can't the Saurus. All out! A battle of will! Oh, oh well, you're dead in one hit. What are you gonna do now, huh? What are you gonna do now? Oh, he's gonna kill me! Oh dear. Well, Super Cool Aid, you did it. You did good. You made sure that I can kill him in two hits. So, one, two, and three reserve. And whoppa! Beautiful. Right, Acrocanthosaurus, the final one. Triple threat. Level 33, 33, and saving the best for last at level 34, and he kills me! Oh no, it's Archaeops! Oh, Eops, sorry. Archaeops is a flying thing. I think. All out attack for a seven. Go bite him, you little warty thing. Lovely. And there you have it. We're going to do We're going to win Darwin Opterus. So it's another 75 DNA. We've got three more battles. We can do this. Okay, herbivores. Herbivores it is. And I do have some decent herbivores. The Monostegatops uh, is very good. Um, I really don't want to use Segnasuit just, just yet. Ah, it's too, it's too valuable. So, he's probably going to switch to uh, Prestasuchus. And we want to kill that thing. Once we killed it, it's gone. And he already wastes a turn swapping into it, which is good for us. Uh, he does kill us in two, however. So, we have to go for a two block here. Because he would only have three at a max. Hmm. Hmm, dum de dum Oh, there you go. You're right. Uh, did he? Go he went for two, didn't he? So he's only got one block. One, two, three, and then factor in the one block just in case. And he didn't go for it anyway. And whoppa! Ooh, 600 attack. Not very good. Did he have a block? Or a reserve? No, he didn't. Never mind. I'm an idiot. I could have one more reserve. Oh, God. Oh! Takes the hit on the chin. This is only level 20. And you're dead. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Bam! Although we would definitely die here. Uh, even if we block for two. It's probably going to go for four. I would say. The bot does it. The bot knows best. So what do you think, guys? Do you think it's like Lydia should be kicking hackers or banning hackers? Um, it just feels like, you know, this game came out in 2015. That was five years ago. It's taken Lydia five years to crack down on people hacking their game. And I think that the main reason they're doing this is because they have all these other alternate ways for people to get stuff in the game that uh, now they, uh, they're they like, well, sod you. Um, people who are paying money now um, to support the game shouldn't be getting gypped when they can easily hack the game. That's what I would say. So what do we have here? What? A Grady survival kit, 50 quid for 10,000 loyalty points, 50,000 quid. Not worth it, you kidding me? Oh no. Uh, I kind of wanted to see the roadmap for VIP, but um, I can't see it. Oh, look, a bonus. <gasps> b, b b bonus So there was packs. There was normal packs that we could buy for bucks. So what do we have here? 12, we could... Oh, look, the VIP gets the most. So what do you get out of this? You get a bundle. You get strong start, fresh funds, and fortified genes. So, out of this, um, I mean, you know what? For 1,200 bucks, three packs, um, 
Oh god, that one's not worth it. Fresh funds is not worth it. The fortified probably ain't worth it either. With a max of what? 1,500 DNA? What's the max I can get out of this? Uh, 2,250 DNA. That's DNA wise. And one of those. It's not worth it. 1,200 bucks. It looks like it's worth it. It really ain't worth it. <laughs> Uh, it's something, it's something, you know, you've got to, you've got to think about it sometimes. You've got to get it analyzed. Don't want to be taken advantage of here. So we've also got the Cenozoic Stampede. We got so much. I love it. And um, they're also starting to put out events, uh, like an event um, chart. So you could, like a roadmap. So you know what's coming up. Uh, so here we go. Um, all uh, amphibians. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. All amphibians. Let's go. Let's go. And we need we need something good. We need something good. So we'll go for one reserve right off the bat, even though we can die in two hits. I'm just hoping that he switches. Please switch. I didn't see that. Why? 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 <laughs> Why? I hate you. Okay, well, if that's the case, um, I'm gonna kill you. Die. Blech. And we got one reserve. What are you gonna do now, huh? What are you gonna do, son? You gonna kill me? Oh no! Oh, oh I'm, I'm alive. I'm alive. One, two, three, and one reserve. So press the switches can take you out, son. Oh, and there's upload the Jurassic World Alive video. Ooh, a little bit behind the scenes. I just set that off. Ooh, okay. So he goes for two, which makes sense. He's got, what, two block, I think? He might have two block. Oh, no, one. He's got one block. One, two, three. He's dead. Factor in two. Yeah, there you go. Done and done. Yum. Okay, the last battle. Another 75 DNA in the bank. In the kitty. And here we go. It's a carnival free for all. Dine, my pretties. Feast on my flesh. Okay. <laughs> got him. Go away. No. <laughs> um, it's that Assassin's Creed video. It brought the golem out in me. Guys, I that Assassin's Creed funny moment video, I thought it wouldn't take that long. I thought maybe a, a few hours to make. Bear in mind, I'd already done about 10 episodes um, of funny, like, clipping and getting bits out of them. Um, it took all day. Like, that funny montage, normally when I go through videos, I, um, I mark... So if I know, like, oh, I'll use that for a funny montage, I'll just put in a marker so I can easily go back through and go, yep, take that out, take that out, take that out. However, this time, it's a literally... Like, I didn't watch them all the way through, or else I would be dead. <laughs> the, the, that montage wouldn't be out for another few years um, with the my spare time that I have, what little of it exists. Um, but, or was that? Himanga Nindus. Uh, Amari... Uh... What would you say? Amari Himanga Arimasen. That's... Little time exists. Little free time exists, I think. It's something like that. <laughs> Not very much. Anyway, um, yeah. So I just, I, I spent all day doing it. <laughs> oh god, that was fun. I enjoyed it. I was like, wow, actually some, you know what? Sometimes I am a little bit funny. <laughs> Sometimes squishy. Uh, so Darwin Optus, there we go. What's good about this is now that we're VIP, we're going to get double VIP points from it. And a thousand bucks as well as 2,500 DNA. And, you know, Darwin Optus, why not? Uh, and 2,600. Whoo. Da, da, da. And Darwin Optus, now look at him. He looks normal. That's nice. So we've done that one, but we are not done yet. No, we have so much. Oh my God, we've got Cenozoic Stampede. Now, here we go. This is what it's a boot. So, what should we go for? Now, we have three battles. Now, I did this last time. What I did is I went one, two, three, one, two, three, and one. So what you do is you separate your top nine creatures into three separate. So the top three, then the second top three, and then the third top three. And you pick one from each. So we'll pick the lowest from the, you know, the, the lowest of them all. And then from the middle, we'll pick the lowest. And then from the top, we'll pick the highest. So, and then the other way around, we'll pick the lowest from the highest, and then the top, top, and then the middle, middle, middle. So you've got a balance of all of them. 
Oh, oh, and would you look at that? It's dead already. This might be a lot easier than I expected. But hey, what up? Or a bite. Here we go. So we're going to go through all of these. Now, there was an aquatic version of this. And you did face up against uh, Mosasaur Gen 2. Although uh, the one I faced up against was only uh, level 11, I think it was. All right. Well, if you want to drag this out, you can. Oh. Oh, no. He got below the S of me name. Oh, I didn't need to do that. I really didn't need to do that. <laughs> but you know what? There's no worry here. This isn't Jurassic World Alive. Entelodon can't hurt me, even though it's an Arcatharium. So we kill it in one hit. We may as well go for four in case it went for three block. And bam, takes that out. And he's got even lower. And for soon. Oh, six attack. Are you going to go for it? Oh, it goes for a whopping five. And we'll go for two attack because he's only got one block. And he does go for it. Fantastic. Wow. This is a great type to put in, the Savannah. Nothing's, uh, there's so far there's no planes and there's a lot of caves. Okay, so one, two, one, two, and then there you go. So if you, ooh, there, <laughs> I can't even talk. <laughs> ooh, that was, that was the quickest death. I blinked and I missed it. Six. Ooh, we're on 102 now. Now we're getting a little bit dangerous with those numbers. Ooh, 600. So he's got two block. We kill him in, so we have to go for three and then three reserves. That's good. And there it is. Bam. And there's another Angel Catharium, 132 now. But we're, we're still in the first creature, the lowest of our top nine creatures. And we are now down to only two left. Now, it does get harder, though. So the first set, the first of the three battles is easy. But, I mean, I wish I hadn't used Mammoth Ethereum now. <laughs> but he might kill me here. Nope, doesn't go for it. Could have, but doesn't. Uh, so one... No, I'm going to just factor in two extra anyway. Oh, I was going to... I, I did think to factor in an extra one because it doesn't really matter. But... Uh, one, one, two, three. Let's factor in three this time. Well, overkill, but hey. And then finally, this thing comes in with 50. Not a single plane. Not a single plane. So I had the complete advantage there. And six, which does kill me. But uh, a little bit too late. Because in comes the Titanoboa. <laughs> Constrict it to death and eat it. Just don't choke. Ooh, yum. 19,000 attack. Whoa. Okay, 100 DNA. On to the next one. So now we go to uh, the highest, um, the middle, and the lowest. Let's do that one. High and middle, low. Hi, mid low. Now this ain't so good because um, do I gotta go first? I go first because now I'm I am using planes. But maybe what I'm facing won't be too bad. <sighs> Come on, we got this. I'm not too worried. I'm I'm really not too. Look at that. It's crazy to think that that Panthaceros or whatever it is, the the this guy. What is he called? The yeah, Pano Pano Panotheus Panotheus. That thing was a rare, wasn't it? Or something like that? Oh no, maybe it was a legendary, but he got upgraded to a tournament or a VIP, I think it is. And it became so much better. I think it's a, it's a VIP. I'll just keep going, just do loads of attacks. Just kill things. There you go, stomp the ground, get mean, get angry. Sarcastodon, don't take that lip. What's it gonna go for? Four? No, it doesn't go for it. You know, I'm just gonna just all out. Just do it. This is to kill him. <laughs> doesn't matter. We won this. These are easy. So for me, this is easy, as you can quite clearly see. So I'm hoping that it's not too hard for you guys if you don't have too many high levels. I mean, you need level 40s though. You do need level 40s because, I mean, taking on nine of you know these guys that are level 20s and higher, oh, it's a bit tough. You do need level 40s. You really do. Oh, three. Wow. Okay. Um, one. And I factor in one extra because I don't think he had. No, I don't think he would have had more than four. And 192 to 110. Okay, come on. We're starting to approach level 11 legendaries. Uh, oh, we can still kill him in one hit. So I'll factor in two. Oh, and there it is. It's like every turn is a kill. Two left. Oh, and it's a unitarian. Unitatherium. Unitatherium. There you go. I could say uh, what you call it. Latin. And what is it? I don't know what they're named after. Something like that. 
Whoopash! That should kill him. Ooh! This is the best of the bottom three, by the way. And I'm not having a problem. So if you have a Mastodon, and you just... Ha you know, I didn't even need any of my other creatures. This is all I needed. Oh, what's it going to go for? Is it a charge? Oh, it's Stone Edge! A spiked attack! He must have been a, uh, an ice type. <laughs> Super effective. And finally, uh, we'll just go for you, you, and you. Middle, 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 I think it is, or something like that. And we'll just go for a hit straight away. Gastornis, claw, or bite. He, he eats just both pretty bad. There should be an attack where it just flaps its wings and hits it. <laughs> and you got a Patasaurus biting. It's just as useful, I would say. And there you go. One. Takes him out. Ooh, a plane. Ooh, careful. I'd rather face you now than later. Although we're already on level 7 legendaries, but I don't think... Maybe it doesn't get harder. Maybe it doesn't. Oh! Oh, no! He does have three. He could do 500 damage. He doesn't. I'm going to go for four, because even if he blocks the three, he's dead. Bam! Stump! Okay, 64 attack. Even less. That's good. Go for six. Go on. Go for it. Go crazy. Why are they never go for the all-out attack? They always leave a little bit. I wonder if that's the... the oh, God, I should have went for it. Okay, well, anyway, he's on to four now. So I can go for five and definitely kill him if he doesn't attack. Which he doesn't. Is that stock sound effect for dogs? Like a stock dog sound effect? I feel like I've heard that all the way in a game called Legend in the, for the Super Nintendo. I recognize those dog barks. Ooh, ooh. It's just missing the uh, when you kill the dog and it goes... Bruh, bruh, bruh. <laughs> Oh dear. That's a point actually, because I did the Assassin's Creed funny montage, I had a lot of people comment saying, Beavers, you haven't even done Medusa. Are you ever going to finish the game? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm not going to finish the game. Left it too long, and I'm okay. I'm doing other things. I'm not too interested in it. Might play the new one. Might play Valhalla when it comes out, if it really does interest me. But, I don't know. The Greek mythology interested me more than the Egyptian and more than the, uh, the Viking. Because they have, you know, like creatures, like the Minotaur. And yes, you have the Sphinx and stuff. And anyway, the Sphinx was in the Greek one too, so <laughs> there's that. Um, okay, so one, factor in three just in case. And there it is. Three left. Yep, it's not getting harder. These battles are all the same. I thought they would get harder. I was wrong. I apologize. Five. Oh, oh we're alive. Just... One, one, two, and uh, three reserves. Can we make it to the end? Whoopa! Come on, Terra Bird. Come on, Gastonis. You can do it. We've got seven. Se oh, we yeah, he's killed me. Yeah, he's got 104. 102 attack. No! <laughs> right, but there we go. Smith of Ceres. I think got a boost as well. Um, I don't even need to do anything. I should just go for one attack and kill it. Is it? Oh, it's Marsupial Lion! In Jurassic World Alive, you're a threat. This one, however, not so much. Ooh, saying that though, you did a fair bit of damage. I'm so used to seeing those teeth and look. Oh, the damage you can inflict. This one's weird. The, I think the eight attack, he does like a little sidestep watch. He's like, <laughs> like to the, to the side. And there you have it, we did it! Unfortunately, a nerfed gold rewards because they don't have books in them anymore. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Did I just notice that? Or people, has it been for a while? I don't know. But anyway, there you go, another 1,300. And to collect that, and to collect that. More super DNA. Look at that run, like almost a thousand again for another Indoraptor. Not too long ago we got one. <laughs> oh, it's crazy. So what else do we have? We've got the Beasts of the Biodome, the Earth Shattering, and the Shake the Earth. Just to show you where I am, I'm in Survivor. I only got 146, so I've done two, four, six, eight, five, six. I've done seven battles-ish. Seven battles, and that's where I am. But we still got two days. I will promise you, I will get it. One day, I'll be like, oh, here we go. Five hours. <laughs> I'll just sit down to do it. Beasts of Senna's Oak, cannot do it, because we did the other one. Uh, Earth Shattering Rampage. Um, you know what? For you guys, because I love you. I love you guys so much. I'm going to do it. This one's for you. That's loads of packs we've opened today. And you know what? On top of it, I'll open up a solid gold pack. Yeah. 
Just to show you how much I love you. <laughs> how much you mean to me. Let's a Tupang Atlas. Tuki Tupang. Or the Tropical Atlas, sorry. Is a Tupang Atlas in here? Tupang Atlas. Should we just go for it? Ah, uh, sod it. Yep, may as well. I'm not gonna drag this out. Deepest, bluest, my head is like a shark's fin. And that's 50 day. You know, we've also got the production plant for the other thing done. We may as well use these guys. One reserve. Ooh, he has a lot of help. Tapajara. Tapajara. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. So we can go for two, is it? Or three? Two. It needed to be three. I thought two was close. I thought two was close. You can take, as well, like, you can take an estimated guess as to how much you're going to get extra. I'm sure there's, like, a math to it. You get, like, 0.523% or something like that. But you don't really need to worry about it too much. And he's dead. There you go. And that's two out of the four battles. See, we're just flying through. Easy peasy, guys. We've got to get the DNA production site as well, man. <laughs> no problem. Uh, this is a very close match, however, this one. <gasps> Ooh. 159 a Lanqua. Have you ever seen such a thing? Whoa! Take it on Microprosuchus. You bugger you. You can't do that. Know your place. You common scum. I am legendary. Limnorancus. Oh, he's going to kill me. Oh, I'm dead. Goodbye, crew world. <laughs> Brings in Prion Suchis. Uh, one, two, three. Kills him as well. Whee! Oh, belly flops. And this one has a little bit more attack. It is three, three, six, nine. That might be enough to kill me. Two, six, nine, twelve, fifty. Nah, I don't think so. Yep, two. Not enough. Oh, maybe three would have actually. Oh, you, you fool. Body slam. It's paralyzed. And there you go. That's that done. And finally, because this one has guaranteed bucks. I think 500 bucks even. Even mm, 500. But I think it's, it's 100. Uh, so one, two. And just in case, Mastodonosaurus. I really don't think we need him though. Although saying that, we might have. Let's see. I don't think two it's can kill me. I'm just going to go for three reserves. Might as well. Might as well, might as well. Look at that, that video is now 96% uploaded. Wow. D like, this is... The house I'm in right now, I moved in a while ago. But, why, like, only within the last, I don't know how many months? Maybe, uh, five, six months? Um, we got proper internet. Like, high-speed internet. Before that, I was running on dial-up speeds. I'm talking about up-download of, like, three megabytes, man. Like... Oh, it was ridiculous. How could I have worked, do you say? Well, I, I, I worked with my parents because I didn't. <laughs> I didn't work here. I would I would keep going to my parents every day and working. Um, wow, that's crazy. If, if the internet still hadn't been fixed before this whole quarantine thing, I would have, I would have had to have gone to work um, at my parents. So, I mean, I wonder, like, because they say if you can't work from home, go to work. Like, well, I mean, my computer's with my parents, though. <laughs> so I'm technically seeing family, but also still doing work. This is a weird, great area. Now, I didn't need Mastodonosaurus because I would have put in another um, amphibian. And he would have had seven. And I would have definitely been able to kill him in seven. But this time, instead of going for like 700 attack, I go for 8,000. And there you go. Dragon defeated. Is that it? Is that it? There you go, Demorphodon also at 500, 100, some food, and Demorphodon. And really what we need is this. This is what's important. Another 1,300. We've got so many VIP points here, guys. This is awesome. Um, also, you can see the roadmap for the whole thing. So what we got? Rarity Rumble's good. I never do stockholders visit. It's too tough. Um, Rarity Rumble might might do that. Gen 2 Fury, I'll definitely do. The Phosphoracus, I'll definitely do. Um, maybe Hybrid Showdown? Oh, we got Metricanthosaurus. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Brawl of the Brave. Oh, you know, I'm slowly seeing a lot of uh, Jurassic Park stuff come into just the general media because a lot of people had forecast for this year to be the release of the final Jurassic World film. And everybody was like, okay, we need to make the ga a game, we need to make an app, we need to make loads of these other things. 
Uh, even though I saw something, it was like the 25th anniversary of Jurassic Park. That was ages ago. And they're releasing it now because it's close to June and July when the Jurassic Park franchise is released. Um, see, so ready to explore eight days. Jurassic Park stars. What'd you win for that one? Oh, it's just any of these guys. Uh, and, you know, oh, that's a good one. Yes. But anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it here. Oh, hold on. Hold on. We need to collect the DNA building. There you go. As well as, wow, all of those. And now I think that takes us over to a thousand. <laughs> yeah, we're over halfway to the next Indoraptor. Uh, I kind of wanted to see how close we are to getting the new building. Oh, yeah. I, we got a VIP building, don't we? Ooh, in 10 days, we get the very underwhelming VIP food factory. Uh, it's all right. I'd rather get the instant creation or the super DNA. Uh, and then the VIP instant, and then we're gonna get even more coming up. And I did say before we would leave that I would open uh, not that one, not the solid gold plus, because it is not worth it. This thing, because it gives you the same amount of points, and you get more resources. 100 bucks and 200 bucks, and a concavenator. You know what? Not bad. Concavenator, a good carnival. And of course, we spent one, what, 10,000, and we got 1,300 back. So. Not bad. I'll take it. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. Until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.